That was really lovely. It really was a perfect day for a date today, wasn't it? <laughs> Thank you for convincing me to come out today. You know, sometimes I like to just spend the days lounging around with you, but I did quite enjoy being ever so slightly active today. Well, just because I can time travel doesn't mean I like to do much. You should know that by now. Well, it's looking like it's going to get dark. Yeah, I really wish that I could... <laughs> You're right. I probably shouldn't say that. I mean, even though I really would like for it to last... <laughs> uh, I almost got gotcha. you. Well, I think I should bid you adieu. And hopefully we can do this again sometime. Oh, nothing. Nothing's wrong. I just thought about how I forgot to take my laundry out of the laundry machine. Uh, but I'll just have to deal with that when I get back home, won't I? <laughs> yes, I do my laundry. What is that supposed to mean? Why would I not do my laundry? How long have you thought... I look like I don't wash my own clothes. Wait, and why would you continue dating me if you thought that? <laughs> Just teasing. Alright. Well, anyways, I don't think it's anything to bother about. I get things done, and I get them done on my own time. Really, because all time is my own time. <laughs> and, now that I think about it, I guess, since you're with me, it will be our time as well. Or at least the parts I include you with. Oh, nothing. Nothing. I didn't say anything. Well, um, where were we? Oh, I, I remember. I swear, I remember. I was just making sure that you knew. I know you can be forgetful. What? Me? Forgetful? I have no clue what you're talking about. Fine. I may have zoned out a little bit and forgotten, but that should be fine, shouldn't it? So, what were we doing? I really would like to remember. Yes, I did genuinely forget. No, I am not joking. I swear. I just zoned out. You know how that can happen to me sometimes. Yeah, yeah. So, what were we up to? Oh, we were just finishing our walk. All right, all right. I remember now. Well, as I said, I don't quite remember what we were on about, so... What do we last leave off on? Talking? Huh. I guess I can see us talking about that. I think I remember. I think I remember now. Yeah, yeah. Ugh. How could I forget? I mean, the... It happened only a couple of seconds ago. I shouldn't have forgotten. Uh, yeah, no, no, uh, I, yeah, I, I'm remembering now, um, no, I, I was, I can't remember exactly where I left off in the explanation, oh, yeah, 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 that's, that's right, oh, yeah, <laughs> that was a funny conversation, I mean, it is, it still is a funny conversation, it's not over, I'm not stopping it now, but yeah, no, no, uh, I cannot, in fact, just bring a dinosaur back. <laughs> oh, I already said that. 
uh, yeah, I did, I did, um, where was I, I was at the, yeah, so it's all connected based upon when I was born, and that's the earliest point I can go back, um, I'm somewhat used, I, I use somewhat my physical body at each point as a connection point, in a sense, it, that that is how it alleviates the space problem, practically. Um, it works. So, if I were to go back far enough, I would practically... Or at least to my knowledge, I haven't tried it. This is how it has worked ever since. I don't de-age, really... Or no, I do de-age, actually, because I'm reverting back to a body, but I don't mentally de-age. I still have the knowledge, but every time I've time-traveled, I haven't de-aged. I've been the same age, but to be fair, I don't really use time-travel to go too far back into the past. You feel? You understand? Yeah. I mean... I've tried to learn the rules. I didn't really get this of my own volition. Or maybe I did. Maybe I bestowed it upon myself by time traveling into the past. In using that earliest point, I gave myself time traveling abilities at all points in the continuum. That is something for future me to decide, I think. <laughs> But I, it has always been a fascinating concept that I've been able to do this while others have not. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't really have much control over it, to be 100% honest. Sometimes there are certain phrases I say in my mind, here's those phrases, and then I think of doing a certain aspect of time traveling back or time traveling forward and it causes me to do it you know like maybe perhaps i say the phrase oh i don't know uh you know maybe we can do this again sometimes and it will just rewind perhaps it's all theoretical of course well, a lot of it has to be theoretical, I think, because I don't want to empirically test it. There's not too many things I particularly use this for. I use it to freeze time, to give myself some space, but you know that. I've probably told you that a billion times at this point in time. Yeah, I, I rarely rewind or fast forward time. I don't really like to fast forward time because I like living in the moment and I also just don't know what my position in the future would be. You understand? I mean, I, I, I think it makes sense. That's how I've rationalized it to myself. Oh, I've also already said that part. Huh. I don't know why I'm just being so forgetful of our conversation. It, it, yeah, I guess maybe time traveling makes me a bit forgetful. Although, yeah, I, I would say that probably is the answer. <laughs> and I think about it. Well, anyways, I mean, I don't know all the rules. And I don't know precisely why it affected you the way it did and if it would also de-age you and also bring you back i mean to be fair i don't even know 100 percent if the de-aging like moving to a former shell of myself is even true i think it is because typically when i time travel i go back to a previous spot um I think this is in order to prevent too much time continuum disruption. Although I've probably said that by now. I haven't? Hmm. 
Man, I must have a really bad memory. Uh, that's besides the point. Yeah, it is... You, you've seen it in the movies, I presume, to where someone goes back and they have to deal with their past self. It's a lot of complication. Obviously, there are implications of me messing up the timeline by going back and changing things, but I, I try not to do that as much, and I rarely change events. Too much. I mean, I may move the right pawns after seeing how a chess match would go, or I might say the right answer or say the right things to a person after seeing how they respond to things. Ah, but, you know. <laughs> you got me. You got me on that one. I did. I did. Um, but, I mean, really. I just... You seemed really nice. And I just wanted to... Impress you. I wanted... To be very... Well acquainted with you. So, I did that. You know, ever so slightly. But, you know, I still did it. Oh, you're right. Uh, I do believe we are getting to where we were first. Well, I suppose that will be the end of our little date for today. Unless you don't want it to. <laughs> yes, that really was lovely. <laughs> I felt like I've said that before, haven't I? Maybe I am just overthinking my words. Well, anyways, it really was a perfect day for a date. Thank you for convincing me to come out today. You know, sometimes I just spend the day lounging around with you. But I did quite enjoy being ever so slightly active. Well, just because I can time travel doesn't mean I like to do much. But you should know that by now. Well, it looks like it's getting dark, and we're already at where we were first, so... <laughs> yeah, I really wish that I could, um... <laughs> You're right. I probably shouldn't say that. I mean, even though I really would like to, uh, because I really want this to let, <laughs> I almost got you there. Uh, well, anyways, I think I should bid you an adieu and wish you a lovely night. See you later.